In today's video, I am going to show you how you can create and sell a digital product step by step. So the big question is, what are digital products? Now, digital products are basically any intangible product that is being sold online. You can't physically touch it with your hands. Now, some examples of intangible products are like graphic design, ebooks, audiobooks, photography, courses and templates, and so on. Now, the good thing about having a digital product is that once you do the work once, you're pretty much set. You basically keep generating money over and over again. You don't ever have to worry about adding inventory or, you know, running out of stock because it's a digital product. You can make one copy of that and sell it over and over and over and over again. And of course, one of the biggest pros is that it is very low cost to create a digital product. A lot of pros, ain't it? Now, based on my opinion, there are a very small amount of cons to creating a digital product. Now, here's an example. A digital product can take months to create. Now, just imagine you're creating an online course, maybe to teach someone about the stock market. First of all, you're going to have to plan that course, put that outline together, film that, do voiceovers, make sure you hit all the points. It's just a lot of things that I'm not gonna go into. It's a lot of work to create a digital course. I've been personally working on a digital course myself and it is very time consuming. Guys, it has been over two, three months that I've been working on this course. So that alone says it all. And that's truly because I care about the course and I care about teaching my prospective students. This is why it's taking me so long. And if you truly care about your digital product, it's gonna be exactly the same way. And it's even harder when you're balancing a full-time job and your side hustle. Now, another downside to creating an online product is that basically you have to keep updating your courses. So every few months, Months, it is highly recommended that you actually go ahead and update your courses of course this is not gonna take you five six months as it did initially it will probably take you just a few hours so as you can see the pros really overweigh the cons of creating an online product I'm gonna walk you through the steps of how you can create and sell your digital product and I'm gonna focus specifically on an ebook now if you're considering other digital products you might want to continue watching because these same steps can also be applied to other digital products so let's focus on creating these ebooks so we can help others and also increase or income that way we can splurge on that new Chanel oh, I, I, I mean invest in the stock market so we can be financially free that's what I was about to say. So the big question is, how do I get started selling my very first ebook? Now, the first thing you want to do is actually to choose a topic that you're not only an expert in, but a topic that you're very passionate about. And the reason I stress so much about passion is simply because if you're not passionate about something, you will reach a point where you're just totally burnt out. We don't want that to happen. So if we choose a topic that we're passionate about, it will kind of minimize or maybe totally eliminate that burnout that we might experience. Another thing you might wanna consider is to also consider a topic that you already know a lot about and you can spend hours talking about that topic because that basically shows that you're very knowledgeable as it relates to that topic. Now, the last thing you're gonna wanna do is to actually research additional information on top of what you already know. That way you can create an ebook packed with value in order to help your target audience. Now, with all that said, I want you to comment below and let me know what topic or niche you're considering for your future digital product. Now, once you've decided on a topic, you're gonna want to head on over to a platform in which you can actually create your digital product. Now, I know a lot of people, they actually go ahead and actually hire a graphic designer for their ebook, but with Canva, you can actually do that yourself. I'll actually leave a link in the description box below so you can actually have quick access to Canva. Now, I'm gonna go right ahead and show you how I would start off building my ebook. Let's go. Okay, so the first thing you're gonna wanna do is to actually create a Canva account. Now, because I've already created a Canva account, that's why it took me directly to the screen where my profile is, all right? Now, the first thing you're gonna do is to actually click on the Create a Design tab, 
and that way you can choose whatever you're doing so if you're doing a poster a flyer um, a presentation a logo you can design anything of your choice in canva now what i do and what i find easier is to actually type what i need so let's type ebook okay and create a blank ebook cover as seen right here all right and i'm just going to show you how easy it is to actually create your own ebook that way you can list it on whatever platform of your choice and actually sell that ebook to make a profit to make passive income all right now let's get started all right here's a good title a mother's guide so let's imagine that we're creating an ebook for first time moms, okay? So a mother's guide. All right, now that we have our title, we need the words to be bigger. So let's go, there we go. Let's say we need a better font. Uh, I don't like that one. Yeah, this one looks good. All right, so let's make it a little bit bigger. All right, now, of course, it's a book cover, so we're gonna want it to be a little bit more eye-catching. Let's go on background. When we go on background, we are able to select whatever background we need, right? Now, now let's go to a nice background that looks like it has to do with motherhood. This looks good, yeah, a rose, right? All right, so we're gonna put that at the top for book cover now let's make that white text it's as simple as that boom can move this up a little bit more okay let's go on google or you know what let's try here let's put woman and see what pops up you know what, this could actually be a really, really good picture because it looks like she's very concerned about something. So let's just say she's concerned about motherhood. She's a first time mom, right? Now, another thing we might wanna do is actually to put the author of the book, right? So we're gonna click on text, add a subheading. Uh, let's bring this to the bottom of the book. So let's say the person who wrote this was Mary Sue. And there we have it, we have our book cover. Now, remember, this is an ebook, so of course it's gonna have a lot of different pages, right? With information that will actually help expectant mothers. Now, what we're gonna do is to click add page, and this is where we will write whatever we need to write in the boxes. All right, and again, same thing applies. You can change the size of the writing, and you can also change the text here. Now, let's just say we wanted to add a picture in the middle of our ebook. Now, maybe this is the picture that's not found on Canva. What you would do is open up a tab and type, let's just say pregnant woman. Let's do that. Now, this is a wonderful picture that we could use just for demonstration purposes. We copy the image, paste it, boom there we go you can put that right at the bottom of your ebook and then you type whatever you want just to bring a little bit of color and flair to your ebook you see what i'm saying and then you can type whatever you want all the way to the bottom boom that's it now once you're done with creating your ebook the final step is to actually download that ebook we're gonna download it as pdf and then, boom, there we go. And there we go, that's your PDF document, a mother's guide, right on your computer. Now you have yourself an ebook in which you can list on your website, on your YouTube channel, any social media for sale. Remember, once you're skilled in an area and you're knowledgeable, people can see that, they can see right through you. And if they're looking for knowledge, they will make that investment. Having a digital product as mentioned before, is a great source of passive income. 
So why not start generating some passive income today? Now remember, any design can be done in Canva, whether it's a thumbnail, a banner, even a t-shirt design. So Canva is an amazing website in which you can actually use to enhance your digital product. So there you have it. That is a great way to create and sell a digital product in order for you to get your passive income game up. Thank you so much for watching this video and I will see you in the next one.